This is Tabo. Tabo is a healthy young man. He likes spending time with his friends and playing games. Tabo is also very good at soccer. Now the government has told Tabo to stay home because of the coronavirus. They told him to wear a face mask at all times, wash his hands, and keep a safe distance from others. Tabo is not happy about this. He thinks that the coronavirus will only happen to someone else. Tabo is wrong. Tabo sneaks out one day to play with his friends. What he did not know is that one of his friends, Sipo, has just visited his uncle who has the coronavirus. Sipo touches the same ball as Tabo after wiping his face. Now Tabo has the coronavirus. The coronavirus is a nasty enemy. It lives in little droplets that come out of your mouth when you sneeze, cough, speak, or sing. These droplets can be breathed in and make you very sick. The coronavirus can hide anywhere, from mugs and plates to swings and slides, from door handles and windows to toys and food. The coronavirus can sit on surfaces and live for more than nine days, waiting to catch you and make you sick. Tabo goes home to his family. Tabo still feels fine and is not sick, but all this time, Tabo has the coronavirus. Tabo shares his house with his mother, his big sister, and his little sister. Because they share the same cups and plates, it took no time at all for Tabo's mom and sister to get the coronavirus too. Now Tabo is starting to feel sick. He has a sore throat. Tabo is feeling hot and sweaty. He is tired all the time. He even has a dry cough. Tabo's mom is worried about him and asks her friend and neighbor, Sis Lissedi, for advice. While talking to Sister Sedi, Tabo's mom stands too close to her, and through Mama's breath, the coronavirus lands on Sister Sedi. Now Sister Sedi has the coronavirus and takes it home to her husband and four children. In no time at all, Tabo's entire village has the coronavirus. This could have been avoided if Tabo had done the right thing. Wear a face mask. Wash your hands for 20 seconds at a time, at least six times a day. Use a hand sanitizer if you don't have water and soap. Keep a safe distance of two meters from others where possible. Tell your friends and family to keep safe and keep your village from getting sick. <laughs>